It's like 9 a.m. so I'm still deep puffing and waking up for the day I'm drinking my daily cup of espresso I have become such an espresso whore lately like it's the only thing I will drink and I recently was gifted a an espresso machine so it's been like the best treat ever every single morning to like wake up and look forward to but as you just saw me do Usually in the morning, I will go over my planner for the week or the day and whatever is going on. And then this is my YouTube planning journal. So I do have two brand deals coming up, not in this video, but I think in the next two, which hopefully you're cool with because it's December and I got to grind, you know? So I was just planning some notes for those videos, but I'm not gonna lie. I have had such FOMO these last well, this last week, because it's December 9th when I'm filming this, but I have had such bad FOMO this week um, with Vlogmas videos. I, every single year, decide not to do Vlogmas because I'm too stressed or I have too much going on or for whatever reason, just like know that it wouldn't be a good idea for me to take on. Even though during Vlogmas itself, I'm like, yeah, next year I'm gonna do it. Like I wanna do it so badly. And then Vlogmas comes around and I am stressed or busy or don't feel like I can take on that task. I used to do Vlogmas. I did it for like three years, but now, you know, I plan my videos a little bit more strategically and I have a lot of house content still that has to go up and a lot of stuff going on in my life where it would just be tricky to do it all by myself. So I felt left out. So welcome to Vlogmas. <laughs> we are gonna do a Vlogmas vlog today. I just wanted a daily vlog because all of these Vlogmas videos that I've been watching has really inspired me to come back to make some vlog content and show you what's going on in my life this day in December and a little bit about my routine because I do have a very good morning routine down and work routine and I have plans this evening so I thought it would be a fun day to vlog. Oh, I also went to the post office and I have a ton of packages to open up from you guys. But we'll do a little PR unboxing later, which I know is fun and we'll just get into it. I'll do a little montage, I think, of my morning routine. It's basically just like yoga for two hours. I've become addicted to it. But yeah, and then we'll get this Vlogmas day started. So welcome to my Vlogmas video. Here we go. I'm not going to film me doing yoga because it would honestly be really distracting and this is like my zen hour. Hi Luna. But if you're curious, my yoga routine is the first 30 minutes I do a flow listening to my body. So really whatever I wanna do, I kind of have my own routine down with that. And then for the next 30 minutes after that, I choose a video. I've been really, really into Boho Beautiful's yoga videos here on YouTube. She so far is my favorite. So I have a ton of her videos pulled up and I'll just choose one that's around 30 minutes to do. 
I like her videos because they're challenging and it always teaches me something new. Hi, the cats also love yoga time. So they are usually on the mat with me, but then usually about an hour of yoga after I finish the video, then I start to have some fun and practice some like more challenging moves that I've been into. If you've seen any clips of me doing yoga, that's usually the time when I will record myself doing something fun. I do have a few new tricks up my sleeve, so after my yoga routine, I'll probably whip out the vlog camera and show you guys what I have been recently proud of accomplishing. Marty and I are going to do some yoga. <laughs> I'll check in with you guys in like an hour and a half. It is a little bit later in the afternoon. I just finished my yoga workout. It was almost like an hour and a half, which is typically what I do every single day. And oh my God, I feel so great. I am so glad I got into a really good yoga routine because it has changed my life. I mean, I've been doing yoga for a few years, but I feel like since moving, it has been like such a consistent, healthy thing that I've picked up and it's just changed my whole day and life. While I was finishing up my yoga practice today, I actually got two packages delivered to my front door. So I figured now would be a really great time to see what I got today, but then also do a PR PO box unboxing. <sighs> Here we go. This first box is from Anthropology, and this is the third year I'm purchasing this. So if you've been following me for a hot minute, you'll know exactly what this is because tis the season. But every single year, I have a beautiful journal that literally is my whole life. And the best journals I swear by are these journals that Anthropology sells because they're usually leather bound. They're unlined, which is my favorite. And they somehow have the exact amount of pages that I need in one year. So the other day I ordered my 2022 journal that I'm going to be using and she arrived in the mail today. Look at how pretty she is this year. Let me grab the one that I am still finishing up. This is the one from Anthropology that I bought last year. If you watched my 2021 resolutions video that I made last January, you remember this cause I shared with you like the first page of it. This is what they typically look like by the end of the year. And this is what the beginning of the year looks like. It's crazy, but I am so excited. It's always sad for me to like say goodbye to a journal, but it is as equally as exciting to start a new one. So this is the anthropology line. A little pricey for a journal, but since it's something I use every single day, every single year, it is totally worth it in my opinion. And every single year, they're just like a little bit different. Oh my God, it's so intense for me not knowing what this book is going to contain you know like what's going to happen what will these pages become because when i started my journal from last year i was in such shock at the direction that this book went in like the first few months i wrote about sobriety because i stopped drinking for like six months i came out i started dating a woman for the first time that's all captured in here i said goodbye to my childhood home i bought my first home i moved out of my apartment i went through a handful of breakups and i met like amazing people so the fact that that's what this book contains like i just can't even imagine what is going to happen in this book <laughs> Okay, really happy my journal arrived. That is so exciting. I am getting so pumped for that like fresh new year feeling. And then this, oh wow. I have two bags of bird food because I have a bird feeder on my deck and since it's winter, it empties really quickly. Birds have a harder time finding food during these colder months. So if you have space for a bird feeder, I highly, highly recommend you put out some bird seed for those birds because it's evident in how quickly it's been running out of food that those little birdies are having a hard time finding some food. It has been so much fun bird watching. I've been receiving such cool birds on my feeder. So gotta keep it stocked all winter long. 
Anyway, those are the items that I was expecting. Now, my PO box. If you did not know, my PO address is always in the description box down below for any reason you may need it. Some items I was expecting, others I was not. Like, I have no idea what this little envelope is, but I'm really excited because it came all the way from Singapore. I don't know if this is intentional or just a sign, but the bi colors are here. Pink, blue, and purple, bisexuality representation. So cute, I'm gonna save a little bit of this for my YouTube memory box. Hey Michaela, we hope you've been doing well. We're a newly launched small business and we're so excited to have you try out a couple of rings, chokers, and mask straps that we've made for you. Please let us know your thoughts and we wish you an incredible day ahead. From Gessy Studios, I hope I'm pronouncing that right. I'm gonna leave their information down below, of course, so definitely check them out. We have these little beaded, I assume they're necklaces or mask straps. And then these really cute rings, which I am so excited to wear. I love the butterfly. These are so cute. Thank you so much to the sweet person who sent me this. I think the best Christmas gift I could have ever asked for was this box opener. It was like a dollar on Amazon. And my mom was like, really? You want that for Christmas? Now we use it on Christmas morning as well. Oh yes, okay. A Vila, Vila. I'm just gonna say that's how you say it. I worked with them a few months ago, if you remember, they sent me that crystal box full of crystals that now live around my house. And they actually reached out because they had a new product launching and wanted to send me a sample. So I'm excited to see what this is. They, I think there will also be a coupon code down below if you are curious. <gasps> oh my God, it's the Gemini box. Oh my God, this is beautiful. I am so excited to see what's in here. Oh, look at that. Oh my goodness, that is beautiful. Comment down below your zodiac sign, especially if you comment often because I definitely recognize a lot of the frequent commenters and I'm so curious what your signs are. I'm gonna leave all their info down below, but here it is on the screen. A huge thanks to the company. They sent over this little card with the Gemini constellation and some facts about Gemini. And then they have Zodiac crystals. They're so pretty. Oh my God, look at all the crystals they sent over. I am so grateful. This is the best. We have this really stunning tumbled tiger's eye. We have green fluorite green aventurine, blue apatite, which I don't have any of this stone, but she's stunning, labradorite, and then citrine, which again, one of my favorite stones. I really have to do like a full crystal tour around my house because I'm getting to the point where I own so many. I would love to just collectively show you everything, but these are the six stones that they sent over. Again, huge thank you to the company. Next, I have no idea what this is. Ooh, La Quest. Fancy. They wrote, Dear Michaela, so happy to connect with you. Hope you enjoy using Revitalise face oil and the Jade Gua Sha from Sophie, the co-founder. Oh my God, that is so sweet. Definitely check out this brand. Based on that letter alone, I am blown away. The packaging is so cute. I really should take a photo of this before opening it. Content, content, content. I don't know, I'll take better pics of it in a sec. So I love using my Gua Sha stone upstairs. It's a jade one. This one is white and it has three instead of two curved ridges up here. This is so great for deep popping your face in the morning. I literally use mine every single day. So I'm so excited to try that. And then they also sent over this stunning box of a revitalizing face oil. Wow, this is fantastic. So this has organic plant-based oils and extracts. This oil sinks in quickly and delivers deep hydration to help rejuvenate tired skin, signs of aging, optimize stem cell recruitment, reduce redness and inflammation, and enhance clarity for lasting radiance. It's safe and effective for dry, oily combination and sensitive skin. I'm gonna leave all their info down below and then if there is a coupon code for any of these products or companies, they will also always be listed down below as well. I really wanna open this box. Thanks for the inspo. Colored by Luna, Luna's her daughter. Look at the rainbow. I love when you guys send me things with rainbows run on them because pride. I'm so excited for this package. Oh, there's a big note at the top with a little card. So here's all her info, but I will obviously leave it all down below for you to check out as well. But she has a Facebook, and Instagram, it says two moms spreading positive vibes through our boutique. They sell clothing, crystals, macrame, plants, and more. The rainbow on top too. 
the support, oh my God. And the sun, cause I got a sun tattoo. This is the sweetest thing in the world. Okay, my name is Danny, and my bestie's name is Londra. We co-own TBT Boutique, AKA Thoughts Become Things Boutique, inspired from a saying that we live our day-to-day -day life by. We are so, so, so excited to share some goodies with a fellow crystal plant and manifestation hippie. I've listed everything we've sent on the back of this note because it is always fun to be surprised. Yes, oh, thank you for that. I can't freaking wait to watch all of your room transformation videos. I am a sucker for everything interior design. Ooh, girl, I've got you, don't worry. There's so much content coming. I've also added a little treasure for Bennett and me. Oh my God, Bennett's gonna die when she finds out. <laughs> so inspired by your friendship have a freaking great night and day and chat soon in your comments love danny and Londra. and then she drew a frog p.s my daughter's name is also luna and she wants to say hi to your kitties oh wherever wherever my luna is i'm gonna say hi to luna from luna soon i promise i'm so excited it always feels like christmas morning and it's just the best <gasps> This is so cute. We have this little macrame keychain. That's adorable. I also need to keep everything organized so I can take pictures for Instagram. Business cards, heck yes. I always put one in my journal, one in my YouTube box, and I have a third one so I could probably pass it along. Friendship crystal bag. Wait, there are so many crust crystals in here and it says for Bennett. Okay, so Bennett gets a crystal bag. She is gonna freaking die when she finds out. Oh my God, Bennett is just as spiritual and into crystals as I am and she's coming home in like a week and a half for the holidays so I can gift that to her. Oh, my friendship crystal bay. Huge, huge thank you from me and Bennett. That is so sweet. Wait a second. This is the prettiest thing ever. It's this little selenite copper moon. I can put this in the sunroom. Oh my God. This is stunning, especially knowing too that it's, they're all handmade. Oh my Lord. Oh pretty we have this little sun catcher with crystals on it <laughs> you're going in the sunroom danny i'm so glad you like my house decorating interior design videos because i can definitely do some more now with your decor so pretty oh my gosh we have these two little macrame wall decor things they were a little bit folded up so i just have to brush them out but these are so cute definitely matches my style too so that's gonna look amazing and then i am so pumped for this item on the bottom because this is the one that i knew was coming and i could not wait no way i have this customized denim jacket with the moon tarot card painted on the back are you kidding me Big fan of denim jackets. I live in them. I always have two of them in my car in like the summertime in case I go somewhere and it's chilly. So now I'm so excited to add this one to the collection. It looks so big and cozy and it has the moon on the back. Oh yeah. Wow, I feel ready for springtime in this. Oh my God. I hope I'm getting good footage because I really cannot tell. I'm obsessed. Thank you, thank you so, so, so much. Also, we can't wait for another truth or drink video and can't wait for a tattoo artist up update Ooh, if you choose to share of course and then she says congrats on the house this is like the sweetest gift wow i am always so like blown away by people's kindness i'm so grateful thank you so much danny and landra for sending over such sweet gifts all their info will be down below if you want to check out their shop i think y'all deserve a little tattoo artist update and uh, now i have to film another truth or drink with bennett she's gonna love that because she loved the first one um tattoo artist update hmm can't really think of a tattoo artist update, honestly, but <laughs> was that really bad of a joke? Oh my God. So far, the tattoo artist has given me five tattoos since June. Here's the most recent one. This vlog just came out, so if you missed it, definitely go watch it. But my big three are all air signs. I'm a Gemini sun and then Aquarius moon and rising. So I'm all air. Yeah, I'm kind of just letting that situation unfold as it is, but so far it has been unfolding perfectly last one i think it's from a small business so this is from the company otherland or otherland i don't know if i'm saying it right now i'm just second guessing myself oh my god it smells so good they are a candle company and the co-founder and ceo abigail sent over their newest collection um in celebration of winter wonderland it reminds me of wonderland like look at how beautiful this packaging is <gasps> matches as a okay 
how come more candle companies don't do this? As a candle company, sending cute matches is like the best idea in the world. Oh my God, they're so stunning. And I do need new candles because the ones that I have out are almost gone. Okay, so we have Alpine Crystal. This one is Cinnamon Musk. And this one is dessert first. I am so excited to put these candles out around my house and I am also very excited to support this company because it's actually a female owned candle company in New York and they just launched these candles last month. This one smells so sweet, oh my God. Ginger Snap, Black Cardamom, and Milky Tea. I wish you could smell these. I guess you'll just have to buy them and see. They have a first time user promo code for people that sign up for their emails. So definitely check out their website, use that promo code and get yourself some cool candles. Oh, the cinnamon one is so nice. Definitely has that like cinnamon spice to it. Wow, I am so grateful. Thank you so much to Abigail and the company Otherland for sending over these stunning candles and definitely don't forget to support all of these small businesses down below. I made a big mess. So I need to pick that up. I'm gonna fill up the bird feeders, take some pictures of all these things for Instagram. If you do not follow me on Instagram, what are you doing? Please give me a follow on Instagram because then you'll see all of these things live time as well as content that I just share over there more than here. I'm gonna link my Instagram down below. It's just McKayK17. McKayK was a high school nickname if you're curious and 17 is my lucky angel number. I also have another Instagram account called You Are Loved Michaela, which started out as a reminder account when I needed it and now I use it to share YouTube things and it's where I post dedicated photos of like stuff like this. So yeah, those will be linked down below as well. Let's get this living room cleaned up. cleaned but it's a lot better also when I was cleaning I saw the moon through my windows like perfectly I'm inserting the clip now but oh my god whenever I see moments like that it's just such a sweet reminder that I am right on track doing what I should be doing like I don't think I mentioned this in the vlog yet I also filmed an OnlyFans Q&A not even gonna lie <sighs> which I haven't done in like a year so that is a very anticipated Q&A video coming out next. Definitely be subscribed and have notifications turned on so you don't miss it. To see the moon like while I was doing all this today was just such a great sign that I am just doing everything I am meant to do. And now it is only 4.10 and the freaking sun is down. Literally the sun has set. It makes me so sad. I also took photos of everything from my PO unboxing. So I'm gonna post those on Instagram. The one that I didn't get to today is from Danny because it got too too dark and I like using my floors as a really crisp clean layout side note if you are in Minnesota looking for new hardwood floors definitely reach out to me because I have a great affiliate program for this company where we both benefit so I can hook you up with an awesome deal I actually have a friend coming over in a few hours so I'm going to try to get some laptop work done I still have to post some promos respond to emails and edit the Duluth vlog that is going up it's just short simple and sweet but if you want to check that out definitely please do and then my friends coming over around seven in a few hours I want to clean up the house she hasn't seen it yet and I'm actually giving her a tarot reading and that is why she's coming over. If you don't follow me on Instagram or haven't seen my posts over there, I do offer virtual tarot readings and oracle deck readings. Definitely reach out to me on Instagram. I have a highlight tab on my Instagram profile for all of the info. I usually do them in my living room and these are the two decks that I have been using. I really love the look of traditional tarot for general readings to people because the imagery is so helpful, especially if you are not that familiar. It's really nice. So I use this 
deck specifically for other people. And then I have this beautiful Oracle deck that I use for Oracle cards. And I offer various types of readings. So definitely reach out to me on Instagram if you are interested in setting one up. I would love to give you a reading. We can do general ones. We can do love readings, career focused readings, what's coming up in the next week, month, December, year, like what you need to know from your spirit guides, like really so many options. Definitely let me know if this is something you are interested in, but I definitely need to clean up and get some work done before my friend comes over. So I'll check in in a little bit. I also took out my contacts so I can no longer see the viewfinder. Let's just hope I'm in frame and everything looks decent. It's only like 11.15, but my friend left maybe like half an hour ago. I've just been getting ready for bed since. It was so great to see her. She came over for a reading and then we just drank some wine and talked for a few hours and it was really awesome. But I'm just getting ready for bed now. I'm putting on my vitamin C moisturizer, which is like my favorite thing in the whole wide world. As you saw in that close up, I'm using Banishes moisturizer. I swear by this. If you follow me on Instagram, you've definitely seen me talk about their products so often because I am such an advocate for like good skincare products and their company is eco-friendly, sustainable, like this is a glass jar. All their products come in glass bottles or jars, they donate to charities, and their products are fresh, organic, cruelty-free, and they work. This is not even a sponsored video at all. I am affiliate with them, but I use their products every single day. They're amazing. So definitely going to link all their products down below. I usually leave the vitamin C moisture moisturizer out because I use it morning and night sometimes, but I also love using the face mask. This is really good for active acne, so I definitely, I almost put this on tonight, but it's too late. I have a ton of their products though in here. Literally all of my skincare products back here are like banished skincare products. Like we have this mint cleanser. We have this uh, fighter gel, which is good for like acne spots. We have this oil, which is a vitamin C serum. I have the banisher, which is micro needle like it's amazing and I always have an active coupon code so if you want to check out any of Banish's products Michaela 10 will help you receive 10% off of your order but I highly recommend checking out their starter kit because that's how I got all these products and I swear by them I use them every single day cannot recommend them enough big fan of the skincare products if you follow me on Instagram you've seen a lot of posts of them I am exhausted I'm all ready for bed as you saw, I did my whole skincare routine. We've had a big day of content. We really have, and socializing. I am beat. First things first, as an influencer, <laughs> you've got to plug in the spare camera battery every single night. I'm currently reading Atomic Habits. I wanna finish this before the new year. I am really close, almost done. It's really good, highly recommend. I might do a little bit of editing, but it's already so late. I also just wanna like, 
literally pass out and go to sleep. As you know, I've been very addicted to it lately, but the sooner that I go to sleep, the sooner I can wake up and have a new thing of espresso, because I'm still trying all the ones that I've bought. It's been really fun sampling the espressos every single morning, and the sooner that I fall asleep, the sooner I can have espresso. If you missed my Thanksgiving vlog, Bennett and I made each other build a bear pears. <laughs> Nothing like getting into bed after a long day. I am so exhausted, but I had such a fun day. I was so productive. I got so much work done. I filmed two videos and I planned the third video that I'll probably film tomorrow. But today really just helped me fall back in love with daily vlogging. I wish I could commit to daily vlogging and I really wish I could do Vlogmas, but thank you for allowing me to pretend I've been doing Vlogmas all along with this daily vlog. I can't promise that I'll do more daily vlogs this month, but I really want to. So definitely be on the lookout and subscribe and follow me on Instagram because if I can, like I wanna pick up the camera and vlog my day. Like this was so fantastic and it helped me be so motivated, but I had such a great day and I'm so glad I got to share parts of that with you. So definitely don't forget to check out all of the companies, small businesses and things that I have unboxed today down below in the description box. That's where my PO address always is if you're curious. And please, if you are not following me on Instagram yet, please follow me. I'm also going to link the skincare products that I use down below. You get a fantastic discount with that. It's so worth it. I'm going to try to read a chapter or two in Atomic Habits. I'll also link this down below too if anyone is curious in purchasing this book. And then I always bring my laptop upstairs thinking I'm going to edit before bed and instead I just pass out. So we'll see. Good night from me and my new pride bear that Bennett made me at Build-A-Bear. Isn't she cute? Wait, hang on. Listen. Okay, my bear and I are gonna get some stuff done tonight and then we're gonna cuddle and go to sleep. <laughs> Good night.